day at the chef's table and we're meeting uh, Chef Thierry in, uh, in our series of chefs in the kitchen, called in the kitchen, but really the kitchen is the restaurant here. Can you tell, tell us a little bit about the concept of this beautiful open kitchen? The concept of Chef Table, it's uh, actually it's exactly that, you are eating in the kitchen. Hmm. It's a restaurant where we locate, we put the kitchen in the middle of, of the room. Okay, so, so the diners feel like, like they're part of, they can see the service and they're part of the uh, kitchen we are, going on. Yes, exactly. We are doing uh, the interaction between the cooking, the chefs, linked with the service team, directly to the guests and to the tables. So you, you and your team need to be extremely well behaved in this uh, environment, right? There's no uh, raised voices or everything's controlled and perfect, right? It's definitely another way of restaurant business operation works and especially in the French cuisine, French restaurant, we, we got the habit to always hear the chefs, the voice or, or whatever. Here we try to, to talk by ice. It's all based on ice contact and a little communication, but let's say we are on stage every day that we used to work like that and focus on the guest, uh, guest experience. And yeah, so like a stony glare, uh, it speaks a lot louder than a raised voice. <laughs> let's say uh, interactive or ready to, to serve our customers. What do you think has led so quickly to the uh, kind of uh, accolades and the, and, the, and the recognition that you and your team are getting here? Alors, first of all, to make a nice plate, we need nice ingredients. I mean, the sourcing of product is very important. Uh, consistency, I mean, as soon as you are creating recipes, whatever recipe it is, try to make it always better and consistency. Day after day is the consistency. I think it's uh, and maybe the most difficult things to gain and to, to have. Mm. Okay. Can you give us a little bit of a sense of the difference about cooking here in Bangkok, say to Hong Kong or other cities that you've cooked in? I always say when I was in Hong Kong uh, and today also in Thailand, I think the cuisine I'm doing today, I think I, I could be able to do it the same exactly in Paris today. I didn't change much style or type of seasoning or, or of, of the cooking. No difference, honestly, no difference. And uh, just finally, do you have anything else, any final words you'd like to add for our tatler audience around no, the world? No, definitely, we are so proud to be listed on this, uh, on this list. Thank you, Tatler. I mean, thank you, the whole Le Bois team. For we are very delighted to be to be on the list. Thank you so much. Thank you, Chef.